Chinese Zhile Zhang showed Joe Joyce that success in boxing cannot be based on blocking punches with the face. Copper Box Arena, London, UK At stake the WBO interim heavyweight title. The Croatian Filip Hrgovic is a monster, if he could resist for 12 rounds the left hands of the Chinese Zhile, Big Bang, Zhang and managed to win, even if the decision was questioned by many, he really deserves all the possible credit. Unlike Hrgovic, the British Joe Juggernaut Joyce, considered by many as an unstoppable threat in the division due to his chin, strength and stamina, was hammered by left hands until his right eye was in a horrible state and the fight had to be stopped in the sixth round to save his career. In the opening round the crude Joyce tried to box at long range and jab rather than trying to close the distance as much as possible and look for a physical fight. So the crafty, skilled Southpaw Zhang landed precise left hands and right hooks that rocked the undefeated fighter. These small scares turned into serious problems in the second round, in which Joyce was hurt and staggered by one of the Chinese brutal left hands. The local's right eye was swollen and from a tactical point of view he was having serious difficulties, so Joyce then sought to put pressure and increase his output. That way, he was able to start landing some hard hooks with some continuity, but Zhang's straight left continued to deal fearsome damage. Joyce's eye continued to worsen, and it was possible that the bout could be stopped. Thus, in the fourth and fifth rounds he insistently tried to work to the body seeking to exploit the stamina issues that the heavy Zhang always suffers. His hooks didn't decisively wear down his opponent, however, and Zhang continued to land clean shots that forced the referee to bring Joyce with the doctor at the beginning of the sixth round. The fight continued, but not for long, the referee took Joyce back to the doctor and, given the horrible state of his eye, the fight was stopped. It should not be overlooked that Joyce could have easily avoided as big a risk as taking on a boxer with so much punch, and he deserves respect for fighting Zhang. In addition, it is undeniable that he has qualities out of the ordinary. However, basing his career on blocking punches with his face and waiting for his opponent to tire was a complete nonsense that was destined to end in a hard setback sooner or later. Especially using often flawed tactical approaches, as happens with Brian Mendoza, Yoelvis Gomez, and many other fighters trained by Ismael Salas, who only rely on their increased power and strength. Certainly, a defeat is not the end of the world for a boxer, but from now on Joyce's opponents will attack him much harder, since they now have the certainty of something that, on the other hand, was quite obvious, that he is not indestructible, as nobody in boxing is. For his part, Zhang becomes Yusik's mandatory challenger and WBO interim titleholder, which opens the door for huge fights and potentially huge purses for him, especially if the promoters know how to exploit the interest of Chinese fans well. Thanks for watching. More info, news and videos at our website.